everybody, this is Ayla, and today Ayla will be grading and flattening out the arena. We've had some recent rain, and so she'll be driving the tractor, and this is our very ancient disker, but basically we're going to be disking up the arena. This is a disker. It's pretty much different than a drag, but what it's going to do is it's going to disk up all the material, and it's just going to help. It works pretty good on this sandy loam soil. This is ancient. This is like from the 1950s, but it's got a hole, it's got a pin, and over here it's got a way that we can put it over the ball of the tractor, or this will also work on a riding lawnmower. Here is our ancient, I think it's like an 02 or an 03 New Holland tractor, but here's the basics. So we've got this right here that controls the bucket. Now, if she wants the bucket, that whole arm, to go up and down, to go up, she pushes, pulls it back, there you go. Now she's going to rock forward with her foot to make it go forward, and that's the rocker switch. Now stop it by rocking back just a little bit, and then rock forward until you find a good place. Now she is going to rotate the bucket so it's facing down, so stab the ground. Rotate the bucket, so she's going to move it side to side, rotates the bucket, now go down in the ground, and that's how she's going to make sure she doesn't move. Alright, so now she's going to pull the bucket up by pulling back, she's going to come towards me and make the bucket go flat, nope, other way, there you go, flat, 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 because the weight of what we're going to be pulling off of here is going to be based on the front. So you need to make sure your bucket is hanging so you can see over it, all right? So make it, make, put it in where it needs to be. There you go. Now, we're gonna use the ball on the back of the tractor. We're not gonna use any of the other hitches. So we're gonna have to back up to our apparatus. Right now she's gonna put the rocker pedal back and she's gonna back up straight towards me. So this is when you have to kind of look behind you. <laughs> so now you're gonna turn a little bit to, uh, there you go, turn the wheel to the right, kind of aim for me a little bit more, turn your wheel, remember the back end goes opposite of where you turn it, now you're straight on, so make sure your wheels are straight, it's a 4x4, four four. these ones are old, they don't have power steering, so go ahead and bring it on back, now we got everything attached, get going with our very caveman adding a rock to add a little weight, go ahead and pull it on forward, And she's just going to go around in circles. Now you can go a little faster. And she's going to go all the way around the arena a couple of times until that's taken care of. Gives her a chance to learn how to drive the tractor. You can go a little faster. You're in second gear. Just kind of be aware of what's going on with what you're pulling. And start to turn a little early. If you need to get close to something like a fence, you can always put your bucket way up in the air. So there you go. This is adventures in trying not to hit stuff <laughs> and learning how to plow the arena. It's a really good thing for a teen to learn how to do. You learn how to drive. You learn how to drive very precisely. And you learn what it's like to pull something behind you. And luckily it's done on private property, so nobody gets hurt, and we have permission from all parties involved. Okay, start to turn. Watch your bucket. You always got to be aware of your bucket. Good job. All right, we'll come back and see how she's doing here in a bit. Give the girl about 20 minutes, and she did pretty good. The whole idea is we just wanted to get it broken up, so she's going to bring the tractor all the way over here. We're gonna get the implement as close as we can over here to where it's gonna go. She's gonna stop and then we're gonna push it back into place behind a panel, all right? So thank you very much for joining me on today's video. If you enjoyed the video, give us a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. And remember to see more, check out our playlists.